Hello YouTube, welcome back to my video. In this video, I am going to show you how to send an HTTP request uh, using in Java and uh, it's a both get request and post request if it get request uh, i'll show get request with parameters and without parameters and the post request with parameters and without parameters now uh, let's check out with an example okay uh, for testing i have signed up uh, to a, a website its name is ipinfodb.com uh, which gives us services like if we pass uh, a request a yeah, get request with uh, our IP address it will return uh, the location of uh, of our IP address so I have already uh, signed up in this one so let me login in in my ID okay so I have my API key here this is what I will use uh, to uh, send the get request so uh, let me copy this in my uh, notepad and uh, in my api api location api so this is the uh, get request uh, uh, get re with, with the, uh, the the url which we have to send uh, the request so if i am just uh, i'll select this one to get uh, the city name also city name with uh, our other information also wait i'll show you okay so this is the url uh, with my key is here and ip address is here okay let me copy this and if i am directly pasting this to uh, my uh, chrome browser you can see it will return uh, my uh, details of my details of my location the, this ip address okay if i am uh, passing my ip address so let me take my ip from here I'm just giving it here and if I'm just clicking enter it will return the location of my IP address okay and we have uh, you, you can pass the key IP address and the format which we want uh, the uh, the response so let me put the format as uh, uh, JSON and see what is the output format is equal to JSON yes it's returning me uh, the json output okay now the same thing uh, i can uh, try from my postman uh, this is an a client for testing our get request and post request you can just try this also i'll quickly show that one also now this is the url for us and uh, i'm just giving giving the url here and this is the key key is this one and it will be the parameters key is here and uh, let me copy all the key here and this is my ip address the value ip address mm, ip address value is there and ip is here now if i now let me take the format also and it is json okay if i send from here it should return my uh, the same thing which we have sent uh, through the http request now this is a get request actually uh, get request actually and now i have coded the same thing uh, in my uh, web in, in my code here in my eclipse how to send uh, it uh, uh, through eclipse and you can see i am sending uh, that uh, to sending that complete information with the key and ip address and the format which we want the response and i am just reading that uh, it is written as you know i have showed you it is written in the json uh, response I am just reading the JSON response and I am just uh, printing the details okay now if this is with the parameters and uh, you can pass the parameters right here uh, programmatically if you want and uh, let me run this first so if I'm just I have given a main method here I'm just calling this function and if I'm running this here as you can see the output As you can see the output all the details are coming even my the JSON response is printing in my uh, console okay now uh, the another example without a uh, this is get request this is also get request and this is without a, uh, a parameters okay just copy this and if I am going to my browser and paste this it will return my ip address here so this is the basic thing nothing uh, complicated just basic uh, get request if i am running this one also 
okay there is some error yeah this error should be we are using https we don't need https it's http only okay now if i'm running this one yes you can see uh it's returning my origin ip address i'm ju i'm just reading my the json uh our json response here okay now to test a uh post request i have uh found a link here so in this same uh, if i'm writing it post you can see the output the post uh, is not allowed to get uh, send me a request in get uh, mode because uh, in my uh, if i'm sending right through my browser it will be a get request now if i'm just uh, copying this uh, complete url now uh, going back to my postman and uh, if i'm just pasting that link and just randomly i'm just sending a request here uh, it's a get request you can see the method is not allowed if i am changing it to post request and just sending it you can see the it, it's uh, giving the response some response here with my url and the origin ip and uh, if i i can even pass my parameters here i'm just giving a, a name as the key as name and uh, the value as uh, hello world and if I am sending this one as yes, post request, please note that. Yes, it's taking my uh, argument and it's printing here. So this is the basic method uh, which we you can send uh, the post uh, request using uh, this postman. Now through uh, code, I'll show you how to send a post request. Okay, I have created a, a new class here which name is HTTP post request and as you can see I am just passing uh, my uh, request to this URL and I am uh, giving the parameters as uh, name, email, code and message and I am just uh, requesting it as post as you can see I am uh, requesting it as post and if I am running this let's uh, see the output yes I'm just printing the output uh, from uh, the the JSON response from here you can see I'm just uh, uh, printing the output from here and I'm reading that uh, JSON object you can see a message here result after reading the JSON response I'm uh, just reading all the response here all this one all these form data and uh, this URL and origin you can see uh, origin is the uh, URL is uh, I'm just reading that and yes that's all from now if you don't want any parameters just uh, delete these parameters and it will uh, work i'll show you delete these parameters and if i'm just running it it should be there is will be a pro problem because uh, it's trying to read a code i just delete the parameters code and all others will be okay we can read uh, the uh, url and origin everything so that's all for now if you have any doubt in this uh, please comment below i'll be helping you and uh, please like and subscribe for my videos and i'll share the source code in my description you can have it and thanks for watching